Hi, I'm Reverend Rose. I'm the minister at Shawnee Mission Unitarian Universalist Church, AKA Smooch. This is your morning intention setting moment. We will begin by lighting our chalice, the symbol of our faith. And by doing a reading. I lift my eyes to the mountains. Ah, where is help to come from? Help comes from the eternal, the eternal who guards you, sheltering you. The eternal will protect you as you come and go, now and forever. I invite you to take a moment to get your pen and paper. And either you can pause the video right now, or if you have your pen and paper, you are ready. Your prompt for writing for a few minutes during which you will be played beautiful music is, I touch the eternal when dot, dot, dot. I touch the eternal when dot, dot, dot. So now I'm going to invite our guest up, Seely. Hey, Seely. Hi, Patrice. Hi, Seely. How are you today? I'm good. How are you all? I'm doing great. So I wanted to ask you a question about that story we were just listening to. How's that sound? That sounds great. All righty. So my question is, when you're in the ocean and you're feeling fear of the vast and infiniteness of the ocean, who or what do you do? Who do you look, in, look to or what do you do to feel better about that? Well, that's a good question because um, I'm afraid a lot in the ocean because, you know, I'm a baby seal and I'm pretty vulnerable. So, um, you know, what I really do is I swim towards the light because even if I'm afraid, I know that the light is safe. And so I go there and then I take really deep breaths like... <sighs> So I try to do that, and I also, um, you know, I have like some pretty intense instincts, and so I can know uh, which way things are. I don't get lost very much, but when I do get lost, I get really scared, and so I just like go to the light, and I rest, and I float, and then I wait for my instincts to kick in. It's a lot of like 
you know, felt knowledge and um, trying to be calm because if you panic, it's just, it, not, you're just gonna get eaten by a shark. So can't, can't go that way, mm -mm, no. That's an awesome answer, Seely. I can't even imagine all the stuff you deal with in the ocean. Thank you so much for letting me ask that question. You're welcome. Do you want me to lead you in a meditation? Oh, please, please. Okay. Uh, Miss Patrice, I want you to put your flippers in your lap and um, put your tail up flat on the floor. That's not your tail. Your tail's down there. And um, close your eyes and imagine that you're floating in the ocean. I want you to imagine that you can see the light and you're floating upwards. And then you break the surface and you take a deep breath. And it's the most wonderful breath ever. And you just float there and let the waves take you. And there's water on your face and sunlight. And that's my happy place. You can open your eyes. Thanks for having me. You're welcome, Seely. Thanks, everybody, for coming. You can tune in to this little moment, our intention-setting moment, every day at 10 a.m. We will be posting it. And please keep your eye out for links to the 5.30 Zoom conversation every day. The links will be posted on Facebook, Realm, the website, et cetera, et cetera. So see you later. Bye.